Go on, come on. Go on. We don't need you to keep me company and you have your friends over there talking about everything under the sun that does not involve me. Go on and eat with your friends, okay? Leave me be. Yes, me and my comfort zone, me on me phone, me got me nice adult beverage and we got me two taco i'm good i'm good and i got me some chipping queso sauce all for free yes what sis what what sis what sis look i don't know how to do this camera in the day Cha. I had this sweater on the other day. Yes, I have the sweater back on. Whatever. It is Sunday. I'm not doing much. Not going anywhere. So the sweater was tossed across the room. And I'm running to the store. Because I'm doing hair. And we kind of got some free tacos yesterday. <laughs> so instead of going to get the hair. Because I'm braiding Bobby's hair. I don't know where to look. The mirror or this. The mirror or this. I'm going to get this right, y'all. Y'all would think I just started vlogging yesterday. I am on two years. I did not celebrate the two year anniversary. I'm sorry. I was just in my feelings about my birthday, I guess, and forgot the anniversary. So we're two years down, and I feel like I should have more subscribers, but whatever. What's meant for me is meant for me, and what isn't, it isn't. So anyway, with that said, so I just threw this back on just to run to the store to get some hair, and I probably, Go get some. We're on a budget this week. We're on a budget. We're on a budget. <laughs> so I'm gonna go to the store and get some eggs. Bobby, get some eggs. Bread. Eggs and bread. 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 I don't know about no chips, Bobby. You better pop some popcorn. That's what you better do. Look, chips, that's extra. Anyway, so I just did the foundation the way I do Bobby's braids. So I started. I had to braid her hair down. She washed it, she combed it out, she did all of that stuff that I don't want to do. And then Sydney, she washed her hair, blow dried it, and she did the first round of flat iron. Then I'll go back and re flat iron. She needs the trim and she won't, we're not gonna talk about her hair. But then Bobby's hair, and I had to get permission <laughs> to shoot this little bit of footage. Okay, so we're in Bobby's room. We're gonna do a tour of her room. She just wants a few little items for her room before we do the tour. And I have to do one or two things to this house before the tour. And remember, it's stuff that we already had. So like, I still wanna hang up some curtains. And there's one or two little things I wanna get for my bedroom. And then we'll just show you what we're working with. We're working with what we have. Um, Bobby's room is coming out cute. So anyway, <laughs> so I braided down Bobby's hair and she got two little puff puffs child. <laughs> so I just braided down the foundation and what I do, I do individual braids, but I kind of loop them through each braid and it it makes it tighter and lasts longer. And it's just a technique that I found on YouTube that I actually like. And I feel like I have a little more control over it. So Bobby's braids with her hair, it takes about, we'll use about, how many packs of hair, Bobby? About nine, eight? Around there. Yeah, so we use almost 10 packs of hair on her. We have two packs, so I need to go pick up seven or eight more packs. So this is what I did. She got her two little puffs. Don't she look cute? My cute mm -hmm. little Bobby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's my cute put and pop. <laughs> So I, I I had a moment when I was kissing her little face earlier today. They kissed that little face. Yes, I did. Lay down. Lay down. <laughs> so I told Bobby she should wear her hair like this. So this is all her hair. Um, she doesn't have any extensions or anything. So if we were to flat iron her hair, her hair would probably come down to here. But, you know. And so we just braided the foundation and then I go through each one. This is the secret, okay? I'll braid the perimeter, the perimeter, and I'll leak this top. That's not happening today, though, right? Oh, uh, if I'm tired, because my yeah, back, starts, cool. it doesn't matter. My and my foot is already swelling up because my foot has been down as I sit on her bed. No, I still get tired, Bobby. 
You got all day tomorrow to sleep though. No, I think I have a training course I need I go to tomorrow. I have to look it up. I don't know if it's the seventh and the eighth or the eighth and the ninth. I have to look it up. I'm due I'm supposed to do a training that um I volunteer for um capturing kids' hearts. So and Bobby's supposed to show us her study techniques just so you see um, she's been studying. Just let me show you what she's done real quick. This is supposed to be a separate video so she can share her study technique. Look at her. She got this dry erase and she put all her stuff. Mm -hmm. Look at that. See? That's your sweet, that's your sweet putting pop. And Sydney, she has an attitude because... She wanted me to go over her hair and take my time and do it. She actually, Sydney has a relaxer or a texturizer and her hair really, really grows fast. And um, we just have to wait for a texturizer so I really have to get that new growth. But I'm doing Bobby's hair. So she's upset, she's in her feelings. Let's go see what she says. Clinton, I don't know what Clinton is. He usually leaves on Friday, he comes back on Sunday. So I have no idea he hangs out with his friends. Boop, boop, boop. boop. All right. So let's see, let's see. Let's What's the matter with you, Sydney? I'm fine, I'm just tired. So why you got an attitude because I didn't do your hair? I don't have an attitude. So why you look sad? I'm not, I'm just tired. Why? Because you wanted your hair done, but you know I'm doing Bobby's hair now, right? I just, we just didn't even finish it this morning, and I want it done for tomorrow. So, but you don't understand that Bobby's hair is really, really not done? You want to pray about it a little bit? Tomorrow's a new day? Hmm? Now you sleep? Give mommy some sugar, Sydney. Give me some sugar. Stop. <laughs> Give me some sugar, Sydney. Stop, mom. Fine. All right, well, I'm going to get some hair. Goodbye. Going to Torchy's Tacos tomorrow, Sydney? Mm -hmm. Going to Torchy's Tacos tomorrow? I have to look at my plan. Oh, excuse me. And we have this sitting here. I don't know what it is. Donation. So, anyway. Oh, I'm getting ready to use my cup to make me an iced coffee before I hit the road. Don't be talking about me. My kitchen's not clean. Oh, excuse me. My cup. So, I'm going to try my cup. One of my amazing subscribers got this for me for my birthday. And I'm so excited. So, I'm going to make me an iced coffee. Um to take on the road. So, let's do that. Yep. 
pretty skin rules. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Okay, my cup, my mug fits in my little cup holder perfectly. I'm excited. This is awesome. Thank you. Okay, now to get this show on the road. I'll be looking at my no makeup face, okay? It's okay. Put my shades on. I need to give me some new shades. I'm not really feeling these shades here. I think I got them from Walmart, child. Because when they broke into my car, they took my little shades I had. So these are really, not really feeling these. So, off we go. And the hair store that I go to is a little, it's a little dry which I don't mind um, I'm in my car it's like a comfort place because it's a small it's a small space so it's comfortable for me and so I don't I don't mind and I'm listening to a good audio book child I'm like what's gonna happen next child but sometimes when I have the shades on I want y'all to see my eyes I want you to see that I'm talking to you okay let me just let me just do this for a little bit okay you know why is it that people when they taking a selfie or something they they got they gotta cut the cut that jaw give them that jaw line they be like okay <laughs> I have it down pack honey don't let the flash get to your eyes so even if they go one two three snap you don't want you don't want that 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 squinty look so you just hold those eyes open wide honey yes so anyway I did go out last night and let me tell you you know I was back on my car is dirty it needs a good wash I see the holes I have the holes at my old house and I don't walk in grass so I don't know maybe my neighbor could go get the holes for me because I'm not walking on the grass to get the holes so I think we're I had a video where I did closure on the house. Anyway, back to my other my topic. Y'all gotta keep me on the topic, okay? So come on, you're supposed to be looking out for your girl here as we drive to the beauty supply store. And so, um, yeah, so I went out last night. It was impromptu, it wasn't planned anything. My friend, my friend's friend was having a birthday party at her favorite spot. So I don't know the girl. So I was like, oh, I'll roll with you. You know, I like to chill on the patio. And once again, I'll have my back to everybody. So that means my body language means that I'm not interested. Why can't a girl just go out? Nobody tries to hit on her, have a conversation. Because if my body language says my, I'm staring at the wall, that means I'm not interested. So I'll end up talking with somebody, you know, good conversation. Well, he did most of the talking. <laughs> but then um, I, I'm, I'm just not interested. I'm not interested. So it's like, do I not go out? Sometimes I just enjoy the music. I enjoy being out. I enjoy chilling on the patio. Sometimes that's what I want to do. So should I punish myself and not go out? You know, and I'm not never going to be rude or disrespectful. Never that. Um... But she was like, this is what she said. You know, some of you might might not agree, whatever. She was like, well, Joy, it doesn't matter what you have on. You're a beautiful person. They want to talk to you. Just, I was like, but how much more of a boy can I look like? I mean, I've tried to downplay my look or whatever as much as I can. Let me tell you, my hair, my makeup, whatever, that's always going to be done. I'm never going to downplay that ever you know but my clothes you know i go out look like a little tomboy so i guess maybe that look is sexy to go along with the hair makeup and stuff i don't know had on put my little dita sneakers on had on jeans and i had on a t-shirt i think i had on a wife beater i even went as far as putting on a wife beater and then i
rather not go out and enjoy the music and stuff and just I don't want to be rude I'm not interested I just finished the relationship I'm not interested I mean even when I go out I try to have tunnel vision I don't give eye contact I don't do any of that and I can see everybody's head looking head look I'm I'm not interested I don't have on no tight jeans I don't have on the high heels I'm not doing any of that I'm just like so anyway I mean the music was decent I was just chilling on the patio in my world and then you know this person tried to, to read me oh you're afraid I didn't say one word but you're afraid you want to let go I just got out of a relationship not interested what I'm afraid of getting back into another relationship before I'm ready I'm not interested <laughs> how much more can I say but you know once again I didn't want to be rude <laughs> um so, I, I, I don't know, I don't, I, don't, I don't know, but you know, I do enjoy going out sometimes and sometimes I want to dance and sometimes I don't. It depends how I feel, okay? And um, so that's, that's what happened last night, so. And then Clinton must have came home. When I was out, he sends me a text, where are you? Minding my business because I'm doing grown folk stuff mind yours and since he has turned 18 I don't really be bothered with him too much I'm like hey you, you do you let's go get this hair and I want to look around maybe they got some other units or something I might be interested in okay on payday that's what I'll be interested but I'm loving my little mug it's cute and I want to get back to my audio book I'm listening to a a psychological thriller oh real quick real quick because you know i'll talk to y'all in death <laughs> so i don't know maybe since i i haven't been in a relationship i just spent all my time talking to y'all <laughs> that's what it is probably but was i talking while i was in a relationship i don't know but i'll be chit-chatting with y'all so anyway quite 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 so at Torchy's Tacos, I don't know if Torchy's Tacos is everywhere. They have a, it's, it's it's taco place, and they opened up a new store, and it was a soft opening, meaning it's not open open for business. So everything was free. So you get two tacos, a soda, a drink, and if you are an adult, you can get one adult beverage, and you have to show ID. Blah blah blah. So Clinton told us about it. He was out with his friends. He was like, look, I got it for free. And you know he ain't got no coins. So he's like, look, I got it for free. So Cindy was like, mom, let's go, let's go. Cause I was supposed to be going to get hair. And I was like, bet, let's go. Let's, let's do it. And then it was so sweet. All her friends were there. I was like, was I just bamboozled because she knew her friends were gonna be there? I was bamboozled, but it didn't matter. Cause I was, well, I was eating. And she said, stop mom, put the food away back away from your food so <laughs> I put my food in the fridge and stopped eating it so I have room for the tacos I really wasn't hungry but I don't care I love food whatever it is what it is and I haven't even done that much running this week but I have the whole next week off I could do two days where I could run okay where I could run twice a day so we go to the taco and her friends were there I think I was set up I think I was set up with that um, and they was like, oh, why don't you eat with us, Miss Basil? I'm like, no, I'm good. Because sometimes if I have a free moment, I like to um, reply to comments and stuff and chill and reply because that can be time consuming. So I was like, no, I'm good. And, you know, I'm the, I don't want to be in your conversation. Just go ahead. And I was like, she's like, no, mom, but I'll eat with you. I'll come. I'll come back over here to the table once our food is here. I was like, Sibby, it's fine. Go eat with your friends. It's not a big deal. And so then the two of her other friends, you sure you want to come eat at our table, Miss Nassau? I was like, no, I'm good. Go ahead and enjoy yourself. Well, do you want us to sit with you? If y'all don't go sit your little towels down at the kitty table and leave the adult with her adult beverage and her phone and her conversation with her subscribers, I'm going to go off. Go and sit down at the kitty table. That's what you do, okay? <laughs> so, no, but they were super, super sweet. And I, I, they just want, you know, didn't want me to be alone. I, and I told Sydney, when she came with the food, when she came back to my table, she was like, Mom, you know, I'll sit here and eat with you. I was like, Sydney, I am not 
that insecure. I do not need company for me to eat a meal. I'll go to a restaurant by myself, wine and dine myself. I'll do go to the movies by myself, go shopping by myself. I do not need company. I am just fine sitting here eating a taco by myself. So go on with yourself. Go on, I'm on. One, we don't need you to keep me company and you have your friends over there talking about everything under the sun that does not involve me. Go on and eat with your friends, okay? Leave me be. Yes, me in my comfort zone, me on me phone, me got me nice adult beverage and me got me two taco. I'm good, I'm good. And I got me some chip and queso sauce, all for free. Can't be free, boo. You can't be free. And I think they're doing it again on Monday. I'll be there. Free. And ready for my adult beverage. Yes. Okay, I'm an adult. Yes, I'm grown. Still acting like a teenager sometimes.